trash collected from Tulsa and many of its surrounding communities is dumped in the quarry landfill to decompose. The process results in the production of lots of foul-smelling methane gas as the garbage rots. To keep the stench from overwhelming those downwind, Pete Schultz says waste management laces its trash pits with methane gas collection wells. Very similar to um, natural gas wells in the ground, and um, we put a vacuum on the wells and we actually suck the gas right, right from, the, from the landfill. In the past, the methane extracted from the landfill was simply flared off. That wasted this cheap, plentiful, renewable energy resource. Now rather than waste it, the waste management company recycles it. To show how seriously these guys take recycling, the building and even the compressor for this plant are made of recycled materials. Methane from the landfill is piped into the recycled hut, where it's compressed in the recycled compressor, then piped a mile and a half down the road to the Lafarge cement plant. Jim Bachman is that plant's manager. We've uh, been working with waste management <clears throat> on a uh, contract to basically purchase the uh, the uh, uh, landfill gas from their property, pump it over to our facility, and then use it as an alternative fuel here. And this will then offset uh, higher cost fossil fuels. Methane from the landfill will provide just under 10% of the energy needed to run the plant. Plans call for it to be combined with other renewable energy resources to help the cement plant lower its energy costs and reduce its carbon footprint. Over the years, fossil fuels continue to get more expensive and uh, we're always looking for low-cost uh, solutions to our fuel needs, and in this case, a very environmental, environmentally friendly alternative as well. Environmentally friendly because methane used to fuel this plant is burned at a much higher temperature than when it's flared off at the dump. That reduces CO2 emissions. So it's a real win-win. And Schultz says recycling methane gas created by decomposing trash can do more than provide a low-cost alternative fuel source for manufacturing plants. If we're not selling the gas directly for use, then we're actually using it ourselves to make electricity and putting into the power grid. He says eventually, methane pumped out of landfills could generate enough electricity to power about 10,000 homes in Oklahoma. In Tulsa, I'm Kathy Tatum, the Oklahoma News Report.